have three more months left of nursing school. Today is my Friday, and I'm about to get this day over with, and then I'm gonna come home, and I'm gonna sleep, and I don't even care. Glasses on first, cause I don't need no accidents today. I'm blind as heck. Nothing can stop me, I'm all the way up. Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, good night. Whatever time you're watching this, I hope you guys enjoy this video as much as I had making it. So it's currently 8 o'clock in the morning and I woke up with some amazing energy and I am not complaining. So today's a clinical day and thank God it does not start at 6 o'clock today. But instead it starts at 11.30. So I literally had time to sleep in for two hours take a shower, make breakfast, and I still have an extra two hours just to do nothing. So I just decided to go ahead and do some makeup. Why not? So after I'm done priming my eyes, I'm going to go in with the Juvia's Place palette, and this is the Nubian palette. It's the first palette they've ever had. It's the green one, and sadly, this palette does not come with names for the eyeshadows, but it's okay. I'm going to use the two lightest brown colors as my transition color. So Little disclaimer, I am not a makeup artist, but I am a broke ass college student for now. And I would like to say that I have about four palettes. That's the Nubian one, Nubian two, and the Masquerade palette from Juvia's Place. And then my last one is from BH Cosmetics. And I would like to say that I love all four of those palettes dearly. They have taken me through prom, my homecomings, and two birthdays and they have not failed me so I'm gonna go in with my Nubian 2 palette and I'm gonna go in with the color Morocco and I'm just gonna add this to my transitioning colors what I'm doing right now is I'm just trying to build up the color from lightest to darkest so I'm going in with the color Zulu and this is the masquerade palette from Juvia's Place and I'm gonna apply that right over the Morocco color so continuing on with the masquerade palette I'm using the color Ada or Ada however you want to spell it is A-D-A and this is more of like a burnt brick color the way we describe makeup is hilarious but that's what it reminds me of it reminds me of like a burnt dark brownish reddish color but anyways I'm just going to apply this right over the color Zulu and I'm just working that into my crease and my outer corner so going back in with the first Nubian palette, I went ahead with that darker brown and I'm just going over the colors and I'm just trying to deepen out that outer corner. So next I'm going to use this shimmery shade and I'm just using my finger to apply it. And I personally like using my fingers to apply There's any type of shimmery shade. I feel like it gives me a lot more control. And then I'm going to go back in with a more golden color and then I'm using it just to apply to the middle on top of that shimmering shade. So then right after, I also like using a blending brush just to blend out any roughness that might have happened while I was using my finger to apply it. Then I use this black brown color and then I'm going to apply this right at my lash line and in my outer corner. And I'm just using this just to deepen up the look a little bit more. Blend, 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 never stops. <laughs> then I'm gonna go back in with the Morocco color with the Nubian 2 palette, and then I'm gonna apply this on my lower lash line. And then I'm also gonna go in with the Nubian 1 palette, and I'm gonna go in with that lighter color that I used for the transitioning, and I'm also gonna use that on my lower lash line. So essentially, the colors that I used as transition colors, I'm just re adding that down on my bottom lid. So I go in with a small angled brush and I go back in with that black brown color and I use that to smoke out my bottom lid just a little bit. So honestly, I'm just not trying to look dead for school at all. I'm not trying to look glamorous or like I'm actually wearing a lot of makeup. I just want to look like, you know, I look alive a little bit. <laughs> but trust and believe right after I graduate, nobody can tell me nothing. I'm going to get my eyelashes back, my nails done. But for right now, I'm just trying to, you know, do as much as I can. So after I'm done lining my eyes, I go in with the Wet n Wild Mega Wear Mascara. And I also go in with the Masquerade Palette colored Giza. And this is like a white shimmery highlight. And I love highlighting the inner corners of my eyes. I literally feel like it's my signature look. Gorgeous. Now we can start with the rest of my face. 
Currently, I'm using the Revlon Insta Filter Foundation, and I use my little toothbrush, facial brush, whatever it is, and I use that to apply the foundation. Like I said, me and my makeup are struggling in some areas, but it's okay. I use this little contour palette that I stole from my mom, and I go ahead and I use my contouring brush, and it's mine. And I use that just to add some color into my face. Blend, blend, blend is your best friend. <laughs> so this is literally my favorite part, the highlight. So I use this little highlighting palette that I found at this freaking clothing store. <laughs> you gotta do what you gotta do. And I highlight my brow bone, my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, the top of my lip. I think that's called the cupid's bow. And I also like to use my finger just to blend it out. So it's like a really bad habit of mine, but I always got to lick my lips before I line them. <laughs> but I'm using this black brown lip liner just to line my lips. So after I'm done lining the top and bottom of my lips, I like to use this lip gloss from e.l.f. And I actually really like it. It's pretty. I like the color combination. Then I go ahead and I use my finger just to blend out any areas that I wasn't able to blend out by just rubbing them together. And guys, we are officially done. So now I just go ahead and I get dressed, put on my scrubs, and look for my stethoscope. <laughs> Pop out my jacket, and I am pretty much ready to go. I have all of my materials ready behind me. So yeah. Thank you so much for watching my little nursing school get ready with me video, you guys. I had a lot of fun making it. So, you know, until next time, stay blessed. Bye. Mwah.